What's going on everybody? It's Dion Avril from Evolve Fitness where we get fit and we don't quit. So today I'm doing something a little bit different. Um, I wanted to show you guys a pair of shoes that I ended up buying. So this still has to correlate with um, fitness. So I ended up buying a pair of right uh shoes, lifting shoes, um, however you want to call them. But the ones that I got were the limited edition from right and Kai Green, okay? So these are coming straight from Australia. Shout out to the team from right Aware. Shout out to Kai Green. Um, it's one of my biggest idols. Now this is what the box looks like. Um, it came in something like so, just a small little you know package. And they did mention that it was gonna get banged up a little bit. I mean, it's coming from so far. I just wanted to keep this box because this is my first pair of shoes from you know a company like so. Now this is what it looks like. This is what it says on the back. Hopefully it's not reversed. Hopefully you can see it, uh, but that's what it looks like. So it's very um, high quality as far as like having that little piece of string to pull it out. And from there, of course, you have, you know, your shoes, right? So of course, once you get all of this fun stuff out, these are what the shoes look like. And when I tell you these, I thought these were so clean when I saw them online. I didn't even know how to act. I was like, I want them. I was like, how much? I want them. So this is what they look like. As of right now, I believe they're going for 149. I had a $10 discount. So I got $10 off um, free express shipping. They came in about roughly a week. With the whole situation that's going on in the world, it did probably take a little bit longer than normal, but um, this is what they look like. So, of course, this is the first pair. Um, this is the second pair. This is what they look like, essentially. Um, and I love them. I just love them. They look so clean. I just wish that they had them, like, in an all-black type color and this specific, like, you know, style. Now, I want to show you guys the inside of this box. Um, this is crazy. I believe this is actually drawn by Kai Green himself. And this dude, he's a phenomenal person in regards to talent. So this alone was worthy enough for me to want to keep. So if that's not something to have a piece of history, I don't know what is, you know? And I believe like, if not every year, every other year, he comes out with a new product with um, Rider Wear, which, you know, I would invest in it. It's not really a problem. I like, I really think he's an amazing dude and I believe in him. Um, so. As you can see on the tongue of the shoe, it says Kai Green, which is pretty dope. But what's even crazier, Kai is in the inside of my shoe, yo. Like, I was like, yo, it wasn't until one day I was taking, uh, put, I think I was either putting them on or taking them off. And I seen his face, I'm like, bruh, y'all did it. Y'all did it. You know what I'm saying? And then his his uh, tag, thoughts become things are in the inside. So pretty dope pretty dope and it says kai green at the bottom i don't know if you could see it sorry for the lighting but that's what you know they look like the one thing that i i was just like eh about i'm really weird about shoe strings um but all shoes usually come that way they lace them inwards and for me i'm i'm backwards i like to take them all the way out and then you know lace them through the way that i want to i like my laces going out and not in and then you know what i'm saying like a loop um, maybe I'm wearing shoes wrong, but that's just what makes me comfortable when I need to tie them. But I have tried these. You guys will be seeing these and some of my videos. Um, the one thing is, is because I am um, a little bit more of a wide foot, this took some getting used to. And I noticed even with Kai, um, you know, when he walks, they tend to lean to one side a little bit. And because there's no physical support on the shoe, like in regards to like uh, the foot itself, um, wearing them for a long period of time, for me at least, is not something that I would suggest. And, you know, I weigh about 200 pounds. So, you know, I was like, yo, these, you know, these kicks is hot. Like, let me go ahead and, you know, go to the store. Um, one, people think I wrestle. I'm like, I don't wrestle. I, 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 I lift weights, bro. Um, but that's besides the point. So like I was saying, when I was walking, for example, in Sam's with these, like I noticed like a lot of the the shock um, or the impact was on my knees. Um, so 
I was like, damn, I will never wear these shoes again out in public because they're so flat, which is great for the gym because you're not there for a long period of time. So I would probably wear a different, um, you know, version of what they have, um, you know, to go out and about. But these for sure, I would keep in the gym. I probably wouldn't wear these longer than maybe two and a half, three hours. And if I am wearing them, it would have to be somewhere where I'm not doing a lot of walking. Um, because again, all that, the impact, because the way that I walk, at least I noticed that when I push through my heels, even though when I walk through my tiptoes, heels, whatever the case is, or try to be completely flat, it puts a lot of pressure, um, like right about here. So that was something that I noticed for me personally. And that was what, two days ago and I'm still feeling it. So that's just a little quick heads up before you know, if you if you're a wide footed person, just keep that in mind. Um, I know like after a, a month or two, it'll probably I'll break it in and I'll be comfortable. But in regards to long period of times of wearing these, yes, I would. As long as I'm not walking, um, you know, for a long period of time, to say the least. But guys, if you guys have any uh, and girls, if you have any questions or concerns in regards to these shoes. Oh, I forgot to show you that, too. Um, that's his, uh, you know, his signature. Um, if you have any questions, concerns. Um, anything you need me to answer in regards to these shoes, definitely let me know. I'm definitely going to end up buying another pair. I'm just deciding if I want to get the blue and black ones, the white and black ones, or both. I don't know yet. I don't know yet. We'll see. Um, but again, shout out to everybody at Right Aware. Shout out to Kai Green. I just wanted to do this specific, un uh, not necessarily unboxing, just more so review, because I have not seen anybody do a review on these shoes. Um, again, I guess not everybody is really that big of a, a fan in regards to going on YouTube and showing their face, but, um, I think I'm, I'm, I'm friendly enough to kind of just give my personal opinion and what I think makes these shoes important. So this is what I call a, a person that's lifting. This is their investment. It's just like anything else. We take supplements, you know, we buy gym clothes, you know, um, we buy food. This is also something that is, or that should be implemented within your lifting lifestyle. I'm not saying you have to be a bodybuilder, but specifically for me for bodybuilding, this is something that I needed to invest in for myself personally, because now I'm able to get super flat to the floor without taking my shoes off. But on top of that, I've got so many comments off of these, like I'll walk in the gym and the red shoes just stand out. It's like, who's that guy? It's me, you know what I'm saying? So, and it's just a really good way to, to start conversations and even people that are asking in regards to training because I have a personal training business, you know, this is a really good way to catch people's eyes. So the thing is, is you have to essentially be able to and make, make these investments within yourself that'll help you in the future. So this wasn't something, I mean, Grant, I'm not gonna lie, I, I bought this because these were hot. They were hot as hell. But at the same time, I was like, you know what? It's time that I treat myself and invest in myself in regards to finding something that I can use that can help me take my physique to the next level. I mean, as crazy as that sounds, shoes, that's just like runners. You have to buy running shoes. So to give you that perspective or um, analogy is the best way to think about it. But I am done talking, everybody. You all have a wonderful day. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, hopefully I didn't bore you. I will see you guys in the next video. Go ahead and drop a sub. Hit that notification button or bell, as I to say. And from there, if you guys have any other requests, uh, like I said, I'm probably going to do supplements and stuff later on. Let me know and I'll see you guys in the next video. Let's get it.